you are about to see the most incredible doll ever invented. Her name is Poppy, and she is the first truly intelligent doll in the world. A little girl can talk to her. Poppy gives her answers. She is the first doll actually able to have a conversation with a child. Hard to believe? Just watch. Poppy's as lovable as a real girl, and she talks like one, too. Hi, my name is Poppy. I love you. Can you help me polish my shoes? Why, of course, Poppy. Just like a real girl, Poppy always wants to look her best. Perfect. Thank you. Her hair is sturdy and won't come out when you brush it, and smells just like a poppy flower. Is there anything else you'd like to say, Poppy? I'm a real girl. Just like you. What's the time? Playtime! Time! And if you've ever wanted to see how all of the nation's favorite toys were created, Playtime Co. is now offering factory tours at just $2.99 a person. An entire hour in the most magical toy factory on Earth. What are you waiting for? Come visit the factory. We can't... Thinks the staff disappeared ten years ago. We are still here. Find the flower. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Poppy Playtime. This is where boys become men, and men become boys again, because it's just one big circle never really grow up, do we? <laughs> oh. Heck. Hello? Okay. Excuse me? Oh. I was like, what the heck is making that noise? Oogie butt. Sorry, you pronounce it, but it was more fun that way. Oh. Huggies? Oh, dear God. Candy cat. Okay. Oh, you're. Um. Dude, you, you're a messy eater, dude. Uh, you gotta be careful with ketchup, dude. It gets everywhere. Okay. Hello, little crane. How are you today? Did I want to know what was in those little glass things? Let me do this. Hi. My name is Leif Pierre, and I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime Co. Toy Factory. If you're seeing this, then you're trespassing. Yeah, we play this little tape on loop whenever we close the factory for the day. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high-quality toys and excellent child care, we also pride ourselves on our security. For example, this facility is full of hidden motion triggers, which, once set off, We'll turn on the factory's emergency alarms and directly contact the authorities. Okay. And that's one of the more tame aspects of our security system. Tame. No that's spoilers. Tame. So, you've got my warning. It's not too late to turn around. I just hope that you're certain whatever you're doing is worth it. I... Okay, I can sprint. Oh, hi, here. Um, you split me with that guy in there, didn't you? Mm-hmm. 
ketchup everywhere. Let me in! I can jump too. Sick. of the tiles. There's only three colors. That's not it. Is there something in here that I can see? What, yellow, blue, red? I can't do white. Yellow, blue, green. There's gotta be something in here, right? Money? This is a train. This is a train, that's, yep. Figured it out. It's that guy, there. See, green, pink, yellow, red. I knew that, I totally. Watching you. Okay, he's still there. I'm watching him. What the heck do? Be 
kind to others, show up on time, not hide behind doors to scare, name, insert name here, uh, don't stay past 8 p.m., time, tamper with machinery, enter innovation wing without authorization, are you still there? Gonzo. And I'm not talking about the Muppet. Although, kind of, I suppose. I don't know what that bro. VCR back there. This thing is not powerful at all. I would like to know where my tape is, please. Hopefully, not back there. Hello. VCR. Handle with care. But I don't. Ugh. I mean, throw. VCR. VCR. I'm just calling everything by the wrong name. What the heck, man? Jump shot. Uh, 
come on. Oh, this is that doll. What? Poppy. Yeah. Poppy. And then box, isn't it? Dude, where is this tape, man? It does not know. Alright, screw it, I do not care. right off the shelf. Alright, I don't want to care That's enough. We move on. Kinda, I lied. I do care a little bit and I want to know where it is. Only a little bit, not, not enough to spend my whole life that he told me not to go. What's the crouch button? I don't know. Crouch. 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 The heck is crouch? Oh, control. That makes sense, I guess. Find the yellow one. It's fine. I'm not upset about it. What doth thou haveth to say? So, Stella, what made you want to work at the Playtime Co. Factory? Playing with toys when I was young. So magical. I could go straight from my bedroom floor to anywhere in the world. 
with such a great feeling. And being able to work at a toy factory, somewhere that can provide kids with that same experience, it's a pretty great feeling too. Sometimes though, I really, really wish I could go back. To being a kid, I mean. And it's weird, because adults are just kids, but older. I don't think anyone ever really feels like an adult. But your body just gets older. Older. The heck and are then you, you talking die. About? Poof. <laughs> Human bodies just can't stay young forever. There's things though. Like some trees that can stay alive even while being way older than a person. I mean, the oldest people to ever live are still younger than those. So I, I guess everyone is always young relative to something. I feel like you got really right? off topic. Alright, I think we're getting a little off track. Okay, yeah, see? I'm not the only one. I, th I don't think that was part of the question. Do you think there's fall damage? Should we test if gravity's a thing? I mean, obviously gravity's a thing, but... Uh, uh, okay. Gravity's a thing. But only for the week. I'm a pro. Didn't even hurt. Yoink. Okay. So this is gonna have to be some sort of puzzle thinking about consuming. This here. Go like around this way, around this way. I cannot go any further. Okay. This way. Sound good? I really wonder if I like, if there's something up here in a trap, it's like.
Everything, Jesus Christ, I don't ever want to do that again. Is he dead? Can he be dead? I really hope he's dead. Don't come back. screwed at first. Look, I don't want to stand with my back to there. Final log. In relation. Experiment 1006. The prototype. Coordination and cooperation is evidently within his skill set. As well as the skill set of all other experiments of his type. Come on. Though still missing, today's events are no doubt in relation to him. His absence was a flaw in the scientific process, which should have under no circumstances been left unaccounted for. That's why I'm making this log, so that the same mistake won't be made twice. Any 
future experiments will need to be contained and disposed of in a secure location. I'm not worried about myself. One breakthrough Shabby. and I'll be back. We must forge onwards in the name of science. Whether those who are beneath us understand it or not, end of... Okay. Okay, yeah, that doesn't look like a place I want to go. Just be honest. Oh, there's blood down there. Or, I mean, ketchup. Jump scare me, Granny. Got two high fivers, and they'll high five you your face. Huggy, this room looks tall enough for you, buddy. Your room down here looks creepy enough for you. So not a fan of this. God, I hate dolls. I hate, I hate dolls. Especially... Oh no, what have I done? That was a mistake. I didn't realize that that was actually what I was supposed to do. <laughs> oh my god. I'm trying to you back opened up. my case. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Oh, oh God. Oh, I hate dolls. Oh, that music's really loud in my head. I hate dolls. I think I've said it before, but I hate dolls. With a passion. That was chapter one of Poppy Playtime. This was actually kind of fun. Uh, Huggy, uh, not a fan, um, at all. Uh, Poppy, uh, less of a fan. I would take Huggy over her. Um, and, uh, the double high five ca arm cannon thing, that's just a need in real life. Um. I uh, am hoping to continue going with this. Um, I believe that that's the only chapter that's out at the moment. Uh, I could be wrong. But, yeah, I, you know, hope I get to follow the story along and uh, be terrified by more little dolls. <laughs> Buddy? <sighs> Take a deep breath. One. Two. Three. Oh, God! Oh!